hello guys welcome to today's video by trust stanley and this is a ts tech talk video guys and on today's video i'm going to show you guys how to control how you use your youtube channel or maybe um, i'm going to actually explain a little bit how youtube recommendation works on your pc so guys let's go ahead and open um your youtube application and it's going to open the home page of youtube so when you open the home page of youtube on uh, default is actually going to recommend to you previous video that you've watched or channels that you've subscribed to and also the videos you've also searched now guys um and it also recommends some other video that it's either trending or related to things you watch now let me show you guys um what to do to control this even more better now the first thing you need to do is to come over to your history section click on your history and wait for it to load once it loads up click on the manage history section and then wait for that to load also now on default um click on control whenever you come to this area click under control on the left hand area of the screen and then you are going to notice this particular section now under this area you can see some information that says um youtube history saves the youtube video that you have watched and the things that you've searched for um to give you better recommendation and remembers where you left off and more now it didn't explain everything but what this actually means is that every video you've watched is actually going to be saved on your youtube history and it's going to be recommending what you have watched and then on default this is actually said to be on you can actually go and turn this off by clicking on this area or clicking on this particular area to deselect that manually scroll down is actually going to give you some information to read more about it so i'm going to go ahead and click on pause so that um it's going to pause my search history um on your own these two might be enabled but actually i just disabled both of them because i'm actually not interested and then another thing you need to actually do is to actually turn this on make sure you have this turned on and go ahead and leave it to the shortest period which is actually three months so it's actually going to delete um your watch history every three months so um the previous one before that three months is actually going to leave it on but it's actually going to do the deleting for you automatically and when you scroll down you can notice there are even more options right here you can go ahead and disable this if you do not want personalization for your ads but actually um i think that particular feature is very useful so go ahead and leave that on and also if you are interested in the youtube survey you can go ahead and leave that on i actually make use of that because i want youtube to send me questions and answers now um after you've done that you can actually come here to um, delete your history if your histories are still there so click under this area and then say delete all I actually want to delete everything the reason why i'm deleting is, is just so that you guys will see some different things on my home feed so now let's go ahead and go back to youtube and then click on the home and once we click on the home let's go ahead and refresh and now it's going to give me different um content relating to um what i am subscribed to and probably trending content in general now you can notice this is actually quite different so this is all i want to show you on how to control and manage how you use your youtube channel there is even more things on your youtube application there are even more things that i would want to explain to you guys but do not worry i'm going to explain that later on but right now this is all i have to show you and i hope it's helpful if it is please smash like and subscribe to the channel for more video guys i'm going to see you on my next video please stay safe and peace 